The power sector is critical to the economy and for the country to get back to a higher 7% growth trajectory. India's installed generation capacity stands at about 220,000 megawatt. Out of this installed generation capacity, 1,51,680 is through coal, 18,900 through gas, 4,780 through nuclear fuel, 39,623 through hydro, and 27,541 from renewable energy. The electricity generation capacity in India is the fifth largest in the world. Power generation capacity added in the 11th plan, which ended in March 2012, was 53,000 megawatt. During the financial year 2011-12, the highest ever capacity addition of 20,501 megawatt was achieved. The country added 16,407 megawatt of non-nuclear thermal and hydropower capacity in 2012-13, according to a statement issued by the Ministry of Power. There are some steps taken to address issues such as the restructuring of SEBs, which are being discussed and agreed with the respective states. Rajiv Gandhi Grameen Vidyutikaran Yojana was launched in April 2005 to provide access to electricity to all rural households. More than 2 crore BPL households have been covered till now. The previous year marked a dark patch in the history of Indian power sector as one of the biggest blackouts hit the country, leaving more than 600 million people in darkness. Though India established a technical prowess by fixing the glitch in a record time, Technical advancement has been on government agenda. The new transmission line of 1,200 kV has become operational in India recently. However, coal availability has emerged as one of the biggest problems in the power sector. But coal shortage is expected to continue for some time till Coal India is able to ramp up production to meet domestic demand. In the interim, the country has no choice but to import coal to bridge the gap. Government targets addition of 88,537 megawatt of conventional power and about 30,000 megawatts of power from renewable sources in the 12th plan period. More than 18,000 megawatt of capacity was added by the private sector. On the basis of its present status, the power sector expects a major shift in reforms, policies and incentives that encourage investments in power generation and transmission for its rapid growth. Bureau Report, DD News.